Hey guys, welcome to the new uh, video. I'm making this tutorial to show you how to make this HUD. Okay, I will, I will call HUD in this because I'm Brazilian. I don't speak English, so sorry if i wrong in my phrase. So let's start this tutorial. How? Um, you can see in my HUD all of the elements has changed okay the name uh, in bold um, the map in top and another graph can all of the template in my hood okay so if you want to change the original format the intersect engine you have to make some alterations for uh, you can take the perfect adjusts okay so i will show you how to make these adjusts and modifications to your game your preference okay so you may to go in the intersecting folder and open in gui and resource and uh, gaming and uh, before this you have to open the player box archive so i'm gonna put in description below the right and correct directory to find this archive okay so <clears throat> here is all of the information by our hood okay the bounds here is if you want to out rate to change the position and right top you want to put in the boat or the right or left you will uh, change here okay so here you can see top and left so and um, we gonna to see this in the top in the uh, left right so uh, here you can put um, bottom and uh, right so what do you want i want to place my hood here so i will not alterate this so below entity level label so this is the level description of your player so i make uh, the bounds here it is the horizontal move and here is the vertical move and 1 and 20 is the x uh, horizontal size and here is the vertical size of the text right so i put more uh, numbers and i changed this option because I want to change the level for more below here all right uh, the original uh, content is in more upper here so I changed this uh, okay naming level I think you don't have to alter it this but I will check and put in description below okay entity map label is the where the map name will place okay so i put here so in the important is this bounds the first and the second number is the where you want to replace the object entity graph container i i have difficult to edit this because i alterate my graph so here is the right point where your face player will be placed okay so i put these numbers for the face player to put here okay the event descript label um i think you don't need to edit this so we will pass to the second step by our HUD is the HP, MP and XP points okay so here uh, it is constructed with layers okay so HP bar background is the background layer and HP bar is the is the front layer so you must to put the same number because 
one is upper than other okay so these numbers will have to pull to be the same number and here is the important because my huge my hood I changed the size of the hood and if you see it one little more high the size of the bars right and I edit here shield bar you don't need to to alter it now it's the shield bar you will uh, see when the player use the shield it uh, have for another video i will explain how to do it okay hp title is the this this word hp two points okay so you have to put where you want okay and uh, hp label it's the the number of your HP uh, here the 65 65 so you may to put this the same you have to edit the MP because the MP is in the same format of the HP MP background MP bar MP title MP label and here the XP background XP bar and XP title okay this is the same of all of this xp label here too here is the trade button i really i search where this uh, will take but i don't found nothing okay so this trade for for below you don't have to edit today okay but the second part of this video i will post and i will record for me is uh, more difficult because my public um, is english and i have to say and record in english if you like how to do and how to make in this tutorial to alterate and change the um, hood graphics of your game please like our video subscribe in our channel and if you have one or some friends uh, liking the game dev and these players this game plays please um, send this video for um, and this it will be help me so much thank you for watching this video and see you later